chapter wise list of all my videos is available at this point for dvd pen drive please write an email to me these videos they do not require internet they play offline there is no problem of buffering and please subscribe to my channel for regular updates thank you thank you for your support once again An interior angle of a regular polygon is 5 times its exterior angle. Then the number of sides of the polygon is how many? This is simply a formula substitution. Let us suppose the number of sides of the polygon is n. Then the interior angle will be how much? The interior angle of a polygon with n sides is n minus 2 into 180. This is the formula we derived for the sum of the all the interior angles and since this is a regular polygon, each interior angle will be n minus 2 into 180 by n which is given equal to 5 times the exterior angle. So it is given equal to 5 times the exterior angle will be 360 by n. This is the formula that we have derived in the previous tutorial. So we can write that this is the interior angle and likewise we can write this is the exterior exterior angle they have been given as 5 times the exterior angle now let us simplify it out so we will write it all again here n minus 2 into 180 by n is equal to 5 into 360 by n. We can write which implies. Now we can perform the cancellations. This n cancels on this n and this 180 it cancels this on 2. So what we are left with is which implies n minus 2 is equal to 5 into 2 equal to 10 which implies n is equal to 10 plus 2 equal to 12 which is the answer. Let us move to our next question now. The number of sides of two regular polygons are in the ratio 5 is to 4 and the difference between their interior angles is 6 degree. The number of sides of the two polygons are what? We have been given the ratio. So we can start by taking that the number of sides are 5k and 4k where k is a number that determines the ratio as 5 is to 4. 6 is the difference between their interior angles. So we can write 6 is equal to 6 degrees is equal to difference between interior angles which is same as the difference between their exterior angles. This we can easily see. So we can express it mathematically as which implies 
6 is equal to 360 by 4k minus 360 by 5k. We can take 360 by k common which is equal to 360 by k can be taken out common we will have 1 by 4 minus 1 by 5 which we can see will be equal to 360 by k into 5 minus 4 by 20. 5 and 4 is 20, 5 minus 4. So, which implies 6 is equal to 360 by k into 1 by 20. Now, we can perform some can cancellations. This 20 and this 360, it goes by 18 and this 6 it goes by 3 which implies k can move to the other side k is equal to 3 and which implies sides are sides are 5 into 3 comma 4 into 3 5k and 4k 5k 4k that is equal to 15 and 12 which is the answer I will label this one in case this is exterior angle of polygon with 5k sides. Let us move to our next question now. Each interior angle of a regular octagon in radians is what? We have to answer the question in radians, not in degrees. Let us first of all write the formula for each interior angle of a regular polygon with n sides. So, we will write interior angle, interior angle, is equal to n minus 2 into 180 degrees by n. This is the formula for interior angle of a polygon, regular polygon of n sides. But we know that but 180 degrees is same as pi radians. This formula we already have from the definition of a radian. 180 degrees is same as pi radians. So, each interior angle is equal to n minus 2 by n into pi radians. We will put 180 as pi. For n is equal to 8, octagon has 8 sides. For n is equal to 8, we will have 8 minus 2 by 8 into pi which is equal to 6 by 8 into pi which is equal to this can be now cancelled 2 4 2 3 which is equal to 3 pi by 4 is the answer. 
So we will write so equal to n minus 2 by n into pi and n is equal to 8 and that all leads us to 3 pi by 4. Let us move to our next question now. If one of the interior angles of a regular polygon is equal to 5 by 6 times of one of the interior angles of a regular pentagon, then the number of sides of that polygon are how many? First of all, we have been given the polygon, regular polygon and we have been given a pentagon. Let us see how we will proceed with it. Let the number of sides of the regular pentagon uh, of, the re of that regular polygon be n. Then the interior angle of that polygon would be n minus 2 by n into 180. This is each interior angle of the regular polygon. It has been given equal to 5 by 6 times each interior angle of a pentagon. A pentagon is known to have 5 sides. So it is 5 minus 2 by 5 into 180 degrees. This is what is given to us. Let us write it a bit clearly n minus 2 by n into 180 is equal to 5 by 6 into this will be 3 by 5 into 180. Now we can perform cancellations. This 5 cancels this. This 3 cancels this on 2 and this 180 cancels away this 180. So what we are left with is which implies n minus 2 by n is equal to 1 by 2 which implies take this 2 to the other side cross multiply and n to this side 2 into n minus 2 should be equal to n which ultimately implies 2n minus 4 should be equal to n which implies n should be equal to 4 which is the answer. Let us move to our next question now. The difference between the interior and exterior angles of a regular polygon is 60. The number of sides of the polygon are how many? The difference between interior and exterior angles has been given to us. Now the interior angles will be given by the formula n minus 2 by n in 280 and each exterior angle is going to be 360 by n. This difference has been given to us as 60. This is what is given to us. Now we can take out 180 by n common on this side. So what we have is 180 by n into n minus 2 minus 2 this 180 and 2 this will leave 2 here equal to 60. Now we can cancel this on 3. So we will be left with 3 which implies which implies 3 by n into n minus 4 should be equal to 1. 
3 by n, n minus 4 and this 60 was removed which implies 3n minus 12 should be equal to n. Take n to the other side and open this which implies bring n to this side, 12 to that side 3n minus n is equal to 12 which implies 2n is equal to 12 which implies n is equal to 6 is the answer. Let us move to our next question now. The ratio between the number of sides of two regular polygons is 1 is to 2 and the ratio between their interior angles is 3 is to 4. Let us suppose the, the number of sides of these polygons has to be determined. Let us suppose the sides are k and 2k. The ratio between their interior angles is 3 is to 4. Let us form that ratio. The interior angle for this polygon will be k minus 2 by k into 180. This ratio has to be formed against the interior angle for 2k which will be 2k minus 2 by 2k into 180. This ratio has been given to us as 3 by 4. Let us perform the cancellations. Remove this, remove this and this k, this k will be removed and if you see a bit carefully, this 2, this 2 and this 2 will also disappear. So what we will be left with is, let me show this clearly that this was 2 which has been cancelled off. So what we will be left with is k minus 2 by which implies k minus 2 by k minus 1 is equal to 3 by 4. We can now cross multiply. It is just a matter of solving it now. Cross multiply to get 4k minus 8 is equal to 3k minus 3 which implies bring this 3k to this side it becomes k 4k minus 3k will be k take this minus 8 to the other side it will become plus 8 minus 3 will be 5 so we can say sides will be sides will be 5 and 2 into 5 that is k and 2k which is equal to 5 and 10 which is the answer. Let me label it. This is interior angle interior angle ratio. Let me write the formula also. n minus 2 into 180 by n. We will close it right now. Thank you.